right, folks, check the calendar. It's been about a week, right, since East Baton Rouge school bus drivers decided not to come to work in response to the approval of a stipend instead of a pay increase for transportation staff. An ongoing saga right. at a special school board meeting last night. School leaders, bus drivers, families voicing their opinions about a proposal on the table to fix a problem that got shot down. Callie Hubbard live this morning explained exactly what came out of that meeting. Callie, it was a long one. It was. It went more than five hours long. A lot of you know it started at five o'clock yesterday at the PDC. It went past 10 p.m. And one week later, and conversations are far from over as the East Baton Rouge school system moves forward on this whole transportation crisis. And like you said, at Liz, the proposed plan to stagger those school start times got shot down. So here's the temporary plan that came out of last night. The board voted not to change the school start times. A a substitute motion was passed to provide updates from the transportation department twice a day. They will also reinstate transfer points for elementary students. So as we move forward here, Superintendent Dr. Cedar Narcisse will have to come up with a new plan that doesn't affect school times. So you're taking a look inside that long meeting. Like we said, it lasted more than five hours. Emotional parents, teachers, and bus drivers shared the concerns. Take a listen to what they had to say. You are asking people that are getting underpaid to now work more for the same amount of money. That, the math is not mathing. How do you expect these people to give up second jobs to take our babies to school and they're not getting paid? That's not going to work for them. This plan will only throw the rest of the city into utter chaos. You are only making these drivers work more with the same pay that they already said wasn't enough. A lot of people paying attention to this story here in the days and the weeks to come. So much still to unfold here. We'll hear more from uh, parents and the superintendent coming up at 630 Mountain Liz. All right, Callie, thank you. So 